It is my conclusion that the fusion of the realms of illusion with the truth and the love that the universe is made of is through the human, the man and the woman, by the life that they summon. Because the human is, like Dunamis, the creator self in our midst. The truth is this, it's our own pain or bliss. So many ignorant and aloof, mixing falsehood and truth since the early days of youth. We have a superimposed identity of a separate self-personality, hijacking the duties of divinity. And ask yourself, do you know who's really running the show? Is it ego on the roam or is it love on the throne? Might want to check and double check where the thoughts and feelings intersect. The human and being I am connect and live life with love and respect. Double check, intersect. There are thoughts that I've believed and concepts I've conceived and eventually received as building my creation, a direct correlation with the revelation of my own self station. If I look, I will find I've allowed over time for them to hook and bind within my holy mind. Now I swear they are there, living in my air, waiting for repair by gentle loving care. And I must rely, cause they won't die if I only try without my sense of I, 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 I am the Holy One in the middle of the sun at the center of the one I am. The infinite one in the middle of the sun at the center of the one I am. The eternal one in the middle of the sun at the center of the one. Double check, intersect. What about the motion of my emotion that causes commotion like a storm on the ocean? There must be some mastery to this temporal sea of bliss and melancholy that moves through me. Surrender must be the key, for it has me kneeling before the tidal waves of feeling that reveal to me my ceiling. So I give in and learn to swim again, once again, and let the eye move in. Now I am riding the waves in their mighty power, no longer afraid that they will devour, releasing the coward with love for the hour and respect for its power. Cause I am the holy one in the middle of the sun at the center of the one. I am the infinite one in the middle of the sun at the center of the one. I am the eternal one in the middle of the sun at the center of the one. Double check, intersect. I find that I'm outstanding when I'm simply standing within the understanding. So now my vertical tries on a balanced horizon while keeping my eyes on the spiritual nation at the highest elevation of focus concentration, never ending emanation, a sacred sensation of desired inspiration that I may know thy will and that my cup may fill and flow over and spill thy love into this world. And Christ was unfurled once again to the world. This is our destiny, the one for you and for me and all of humanity. It's about becoming aware, conscious of water and air, and filling our world with care. We worship in the dome, chant to the ohm, and invite people home. We're on a journey together, no matter the weather, forever and ever, in eternal oneness, one for all and all for one. Amen.